Denise and Stephen, what name would you like to give your child? And what is it that you are asking from God at this time? You've asked to have your child baptized. In doing so, you're also accepting the responsibility to raise him in the practice of the faith. It will be your duty to bring him up to keep God's commandments as Christ taught us. By loving God and by loving our neighbor. Do you understand what you're undertaking? Lance and Karen. Are you ready to help Denise and Stephen in their duty as Christian parents? Yes. Calling on thee. 
my prayer for all of us. That we take some of our membership cards, even though we can see them, that we take some of those memberships very, very seriously and give our lives uh, to, to those memberships. So this is the moment. We're going to begin the actual baptism ceremony uh, with a, a blessing of the water. Um, water which in itself isn't going to do a whole lot of that to make any uh, but which is symbolic of uh, the life that comes from water and the cleansing power that water has. Um, then we're going to renew our faith together
nowadays, at least the British king, queen, is anointed with oil. And the sign is that this is a special person. Andrew is a special person. So we're going to anoint him with holy oil. God the Father of all the Lord Jesus Christ has freed you, Andrew, from sin and given you a new birth by water and the Holy Spirit and welcomed you into his holy people. He now anoints you with the prison of salvation as Christ was anointed a priest, prophet, and king. So may you live always as a member of his body, sharing everlasting life. Hi there. Hi, Godfather. Hi, Godmother. <laughs> Hi, Godfather's former boss. <laughs> it's hard with the window. Ah, there we go. I know.